Hello, everyone, and welcome to this edition of Friday Night Silliness. Today, we are playing Battleborn. And uh, I don't know much about this game. Joseph definitely knows more than I do, which he is here today, so say hello. Salutations, all. <laughs> and uh, so I guess it's kind of like, I, I watched a couple previews. We even did a little bit of gameplay of this last week uh, on our uh, spare time. And uh, I guess it's a little bit like, uh, kind of like Overwatch and Borderlands put together, or at least in my opinion. And uh, so we're going to go here and uh, go ahead and uh, start a new campaign. Or no, I think, well, we're doing a prologue, right? <clears throat> yeah, we're doing, the, uh, we're doing the prologue, and just to get this out of the way and have fun, it's a good uh, example of the game's troopiness. Oh, hi. It's the loop apocalypse. Oh. The <laughs> loop <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so what's kind of like the story behind Battleborn, for those that <clears throat> don't know already? Um, Battleborn takes place basically towards the end of the universe when there's only one star left that was predicted in the tablets of old of the first civilization. And they said, when the last star shone in the sky... That others would band together from the chaos battling around it to defend it from the darkness returning. Oh, okay. Very nice. And there is a plethora of heroes, and... Uh, so what we're going to do now is, we actually already did some gameplay of this, so what we're doing is replaying our prologue that we did. <coughs> and uh, in the meantime, uh, we're going to also go ahead and... Uh, Maybe tell you a little bit of a few of the Let's characters you up to speed, and uh, shall we? So what's upon a whole and go through some of those. So uh, what what's your what's your favorite character? So far, known universe, I haven't really had a chance to play much of this. <clears throat> I don't really have any favorites yet. I can catch it. Because you have to unlock every character. Oh. So it's, it's it takes a while. Well don't you get like a starter character that you have to play as? No, you get a starter selection of like four. Oh, okay. But the character that you play in the prologue, this character, uh -huh. you don't have access to until like level 34. Oh. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like, uh, like, like if you play a few racing games. Like, I, I love racing games. It's sort of like when you play like Forza Horizon 2 or 3, there's like a starter car, or like the signature car that you have to race as to get to where the party is, and you race as that car, but then once you start in a campaign mode, then you have to pick your car that you're going to play as. Kind of like that. Yeah, like that. <laughs> that's what that's the other Yeah, I, I really like the, uh, I really like the colors. Thrilled to see um, you too, Melka. And, uh, the graphics seem pretty, uh, yeah. pretty clear and awesome. Very, uh, HD. Yep. Yeah, this is a pretty fun game. It, it, it lost the battle to, um, Overwatch. But I don't know why. Yeah, because it does look a little bit like Overwatch. Some of the ways the uh, the weapons shoot, you know, some of the movement of the different characters, the way they move around. But uh, I guess it would be like the uh, like the the step brother or the or the middle child, <laughs> the, the middle child that kind of got forgotten about for a second. Like I don't know, it's a pretty stupid analogy, never mind. But, it's still pretty awesome. <laughs> I wonder if there's any, uh, are there any glitches in this game? Like, are there... I haven't seen a lot on the glitches. Uh, there might be a few, but no one's really speaking about them that I've seen. Because it seems like every game that I play, there's always that one uh, enemy or opponent that you shoot, and then they somehow explode and just fly out into space. <laughs> Those are my favorite. I played a uh, uh, 
this is a Borderlands video that I did a while ago, and I shot, uh, I was playing a Borderlands pre-sequel, and I shot a Kraken, and then the, and then the you know how like each enemy shoots a release and stuff like that? Oh yeah, yeah, cash or ammo or whatever. Well the ammo flew like way out into space, <laughs> like oh there it goes, oh. No, come back, I don't want to. Oh, okay, you're gonna... okay, here I come. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> yeah. So this is a game that I wanted to do for a while for the actual recording <clears throat> since I uh, bought it. And also, I have a friend, Fleet Master Eddie, who... Uh, prefers this over Overwatch, and I can see why, because it's got that really nice and kooky feel to it, so it's a lot of fun, and I'm hoping sooner or later we can get him to come in and talk on this stuff, or maybe I can just go game with him. Yeah, we're, we've been, we've been trying to get Fleet Master Eddie for a while, uh, maybe he might even be able to join us on uh, what we're going to, we're going to make a Let's Play series out of this. Uh, so, uh, I think we're just gonna start a totally new game under my profile, and then go and just uh, do like a let's yeah do a let's play, and then if he's available, he might be able to uh, join us. All his info, uh, since I think he probably knows more about. Seriously, right hand. She's been leading the generator. Yeah, so uh, that'll be coming out. Uh, it usually takes about a quarter those were her too. for us and to come up with a whole sure new series of something. I guess we're, about to find uh, out. we're working on another series not far from the currently, phase. which I won't tell you guys yet. It's a secret. <laughs> uh, but that'll come out February 6th. And uh, that'll be exciting. Um, and of course, we are still working on our Fallout list. Yes. So, uh, we actually are done. We've completed Season 2, and uh, that'll come out February 1st. Uh, so for those of you that have been watching and are waiting for our next new set of videos for that series, uh, you have uh, on uh, New Year's Day, actually. So uh, that's exciting. Lots of new funny stuff that we did. Lots Ooh, of uh, I like this guy. Uh, cheesy add-ons, but I did, but I don't care. He was hilarious when I had to do this. <laughs> like funny, like we make a, like somebody does something, we make a reference to like a, a random video or a random clip. Uh, I would show the clip in the corner of the screen, or, <laughs> you know, or something like that. But uh, what can I say? I, I, I'm not exactly the most professional video editor person, but uh, I don't care, I have a lot of fun doing it, maybe, maybe one of these days uh, we'll get somebody who's very talented at video editing. He or she can uh, do that for us. But until then, uh, it's actually just me editing videos, and uh, we still have lots of fun, no matter what. So. Oh yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny if that was a song that played over some kind of intercom. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I, I would totally play that over an intercom. I would. I really would. Like, wait, did I leave this thing on? Oh crap! Ah. Like whoever. Whoever, like, evil war <laughs> warlord owns this castle, he's like in the bathroom, brushing his teeth, and sort of singing to the shower. This is it. Popcorn is the ready, everyone. Uh, whatever. <laughs> the show's about to start. <laughs> that should buy us some time. Now we gotta get Deandy out of here. Hurry to the rendezvous point. All right, girls, I'm on my way. Fine. Party pooper. Party pooper. 
I think we'll be able to show the rest of this since it looks like we are out of time. But uh, if you guys want to check out the unedited version, you'll get to see the uh, boss this, fight. Yeah, the rest of the gameplay we did right after this, after the boss fight, uh, you can do so by clicking on the video in the next screen. Uh, and as always, if you enjoyed, click like and share, subscribe if you're new, and we will see you next time. Yay!